guys, welcome back to our channel and hope you guys are doing well. Today we are at the George F. Hustler Memorial Plaza. Today we are just going to be going around the park and checking out some of the things that this park offers. Let's get going. It's super sunny outside and it's the May long weekend, so we thought we'd come here. We actually had no place to go since half the places are closed due to COVID-19. We also heard that there's a bunch of cherry blossoms here. The colors are so nice. Also, when we got out of the car, the fragrance was so nice. Look at this guys, it's actually so nice. The color of the cherry blossoms itself is beautiful. So there's a bunch of like trials and stuff here to walk or cycle or skateboard or whatever you wanna do. Some people are also camping. I'm not sure if you can see, but some of them are. This is a statue of George Francis Hustler and he was the principal of Bennett School. He dedicated his personal life to his students and families here at the Cloverdale community. So as you can see, right now we are at the Lewis McKenney Riverfront Park. It was about a four minute drive from the George Hassler Park. And like I said before, we're just going to be taking a short walk around the park and kind of just seeing what it offers. Let's go. So while we were walking, we found this path only for cyclers, but I'm pretty sure you can uh, roller skate or sometimes even just skateboard. So this would be a great place to visit on a sunny day or just if you want to go on a one day trip here in Edmonton. There also seem to be a few stairs here, so let's see where that leads us. Come on. So right now we're here during the May long weekend and if you don't already know, Monday is actually Victoria Day. So Victoria Day is to celebrate the birth of Queen Victoria. Um, and also there's an area to kind of just relax there. And there's water for like kayaking or canoeing. It's kind of a nice little area to just kind of chillax with your family or friends. There's a few umbrellas for some shade. So there's also kind of like a little park there. We'll also go down there and kind of check out what that area is. So there's a few tables for like picnics and stuff. And then there's the water. It's like this really large river. And then that's the bridge we crossed to come here. Vedit's a pretty adventurous person. He loves climbing and hiking and stuff. So he just kind of wanted to try this and see the Saskatchewan River close up. And if your children are doing this, make sure they're careful. see there is an elevator but there's also a few stairs in case the elevator is full or if you just want to get some more exercise right now we're just going up the elevator to see what's up there So the view here is actually nice. It would have been even better if the water was blue, but that's fine. It's still really nice here. So this is the Saskatchewan River Valley, and it's kind of just a look at from here to the water. There's kind of like a lift thing. I really want to go on it and can just kind of check it out. The lift was full, so we're just going to use the stairs to go back up and then come down on the lift.
So there's a really large patio-like space up here. There are a lot of electric scooters all over downtown Edmonton and you just need to scan the QR code on the scooter and then you can rent it. I'm starting to get hungry sis. We'll get some snacks on the way back. So we got some protein from La Poutine, and I got the supreme, it's with the bacon, um, sour cream and onion, and then some green onions. We also have, just have a cheese protein and a protein sauce. Super good, guys. Definitely recommend trying this out. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and if you did, make sure to give this video a big thumbs up, and subscribe to our YouTube channel. If you've ever come here, make sure to comment down below. Adios, amigos.